morning. I woke up wet this morning because there was a lot of condensation in my tent and raindrops on my tent. Not because it rained, but because the trees were peeing on it all night. So it's wet again <laughs> and it's foggy. But the sun should be coming out later today, so we might be able to dry things, which would be nice. And we're hopefully gonna be able to stop at a camp store today and get more ice cream, which would make me very happy. <laughs> also, my knees are unhappy. And every morning I wake up and think like Darla and go, wake up fishy. They don't listen. That's such as life. We're climbing a mountain, a couple of mountains today. Basically the whole day looks like up, down, up, down, up, down. Oh wait, that's every day. Okay. <laughs> I'm hiking with a full belly because he just got trail magic from caveman his son through hiked so he comes out here so we were his sixth time out doing trail magic for this year and he's been feeding 20 to 30 people every time he makes a great chili and it was a blast hanging out and I've got snacks for the road and I drive my tent out because MC reminded me because I had forgotten so we we're happy and now we're hiking again because we burned a lot of time but it was worth it. Thank you, caveman. These trees are so tall. All right, I am willing to amend my opinion of the Shenies. The first day, not a good showing. The second day was a little rainy, a little wet, but it was cool. And we got trail magic. And we stopped at our first wayside, which was admittedly quite a bit off the path. But the blackberry milkshakes and ice cream were worth it. And today, it's been beautiful, sun is out, it's, we've got a nice breeze, it's not super humid, I got my tent dried out, we got trail magic again today, we just stopped at a pit toilet, we've met a ton of super nice day hikers, and we're on our way to the camp store right now to get ice cream, which I'm pretty excited about, but they close at 5, so we gotta roll to get there. And my knee has been doing better this afternoon, which is great. And we've gotten a lot of really nice views today. So I see what MC is talking about with liking the Shenies. Because it's beautiful. And the terrain has been really fun to walk through. Also, I've been pretty impressed with the trail maintenance. Um, and we passed like a trail maintainer that was cutting back um, the overgrown brush today too. So thank you guys for doing that for us. Because it's nice to have to worry slightly less about ticks. So there we go. Shenny's, not so bad. I am genuinely enjoying them today. We made it to the Lost Mountain Wayside and I have not one, not two, but three ice creams and a candy bar for later. I'm living my best life. Snapshot. Cheers. Ice cream. Ice cream. So happy. Are you recording? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> MC, do you want to tell me why this place is special and where we are right now? So right now we are at the Lewis Mountain Campground. And the reason why this place is so special is that two years ago, uh, during my internship here in Shenandoah National Park, uh, actually, just up that a ways a bit, I was going for a hike and ran into a couple of people with big backpacks and I just started chatting with them and it turns out that they were Appalachian Trail through hikers and it was an old retired couple in their 60s or so and they just seemed to be having the time of their lives as they talked about how they were through hiking the trail and it was after that conversation that I made the decision that this is something that I wanted to do. Awesome. Well, we're camped out on top of Bear Fence Mountain tonight with um, two other people and I am tented with, um, you know, 
my vestibule is staked in MC's vestibule on that side. And then Snapshot's vestibule on that side. So, we is very close. <laughs> also, the sun looked like the sun over, what is it, Tatooine? I don't know. It was just a red orb today. It was really pretty. It reminded me of Star Wars. <laughs> We also met some uh, really cool German tourists who were here, and they stopped and talked to us about backpacking for a while, so that was pretty cool. Um, happy trails, guys. And what else did we do today? Oh my gosh, I ate so much food. It was such a good day today. Tell like, me about how much ice cream you had. Oh, <laughs> well, so we stopped it at, um, what was the, what was the way that we stopped at? Lewis it was Mountain. Lewis Mountain Campground Store. And we got there like 20 minutes before they closed, and then I got, um three ice cream bars <laughs> well i got a i got a cookie and ice cream sandwich and that was really delicious and then i got one of those cones like ice cream cones that has like the peanuts on top and the chocolate and then i got a creamsicle but i should have got a second creamsicle i should have gone for the four because i definitely could have eaten it and then we all packed out sandwiches from the camp store and i got popcorn because i skipped movie night the last time the guys did it so i didn't get any popcorn so yeah it was delicious and my belly is full and it was a really good day today. I ate so much food. It was so good. It was so good. And then tomorrow we're doing like a shorter day um, so that we are camping at Big Meadows tomorrow night and we're doing like a three-ish mile round trip so we can go down to um, Camp Rapidam where MC interned um, a couple summers ago. So we're pretty excited to see that. Um, yeah. What, did anything else exciting happen today, guys? Uh, trail magic. Trail magic, yeah, trail magic was really good. Cape Man's trail magic was delicious. I had two bowls of chili and three bags of chips and two things of cookies and a bag of carrots and hummus and a cup of coffee. Guys, the hiker hunger is set in with a vengeance. We've been doing good. <laughs> so we're gonna get some sleep. Um, this is the first night we've been in camp before like 7.15 in the last couple of days. So we've been taking advantage of it and just chilling. It's been so nice, but yeah, good night everyone.